What if humans could regrow limbs? Hey there, welcome to my channel. I'm here to make science easy and fun for you. So if you like that, make sure to subscribe. Let's get to the video. Imagine losing an arm in a terrible accident and then growing it back. Salamanders can do that, but why can't we? We're more closely related to salamanders than they are to each other. We both share a common ancestor way back in the past. And if we go back far enough, we all had the ability to regenerate our limbs. But over time, most of us lost that ability. But if we could regrow our arms and legs, it would change medicine forever. There'd be no need for prosthetics if we could just grow a replacement body part. Now, this wouldn't be easy. It would require rewriting our DNA and changing how we use energy. See, when you cut off a salamander's leg, it doesn't just heal like a cut or a broken bone. The cells at the end of the limb actually to differentiate. That means their specialized cells go back to being stem cells, so they can become any type of cell again. Then the stem cells move in from the sides and start to replace the lost cells. The new cells start to organize into nerves, muscles, bones, and skin. And after a few months, a whole new limb grows in its place. We don't have this ability anymore. If you were to cut off someone's arm, the wound would heal, but it would just be a stump. No amount of medical care could turn that stump into a new arm. The cells just can't de-differentiate like they do in salamanders, but we're working on it. Scientists have found ways to make human cells de-differentiate. They just can't control where those cells go once they become stem cells. They also haven't figured out how to regrow a limb the way a salamander does. It might take years or even decades before we can grow new body parts the way salamanders do. But if we can figure it out, it would change the world of medicine. There'd be no need for organ donors or long waiting lists for new limbs. As doctors could just help patients grow their own replacements. But until then, we'll just have to make do with what we've got. So if you ever lose a finger in a terrible accident, just remember, it could have been much worse. You could have lost an arm or a leg. If that happened, you'd probably want to watch this video. Regeneration could be our future. So if you like this video and want to learn more about biology breakthroughs, make sure to subscribe. I'll see you next time.